Well, I don't know how it keeps on happening, people. I don't. I really don't, man. I get in my truck. I've washed my clothes today. I don't know how this keeps on happening. I get in my truck. I, I turn over the key, not to start it, but just to, and I look over and it's 144. Oh, it's not 144 where I'm at because right now it's actually 12 o'clock. It's not even one o'clock yet. But my stupid radio is an hour ahead. I don't, I don't even understand it. Well, I'll tell you this. If anybody's looked at the moon the last few nights, tell me what color it is. The other day I, I, I googled, is there supposed to be a blood moon this year? back about three or four days ago and there was just like a crescent you know it was in the crescent form you know a little bit more than a crescent but you know that that every night every night this week the sun's been red i don't know if it's a blood moon or what and i doubt it has anything to do with any kind of smog or anything you know, I know people sit here and said a lot of a, a lot of America is being affected by wildfires. Well, if you do look, I can guarantee you somebody's setting these wildfires. I can guarantee you that. Look, you can just Google it and you'll find a map where it'll show you where all the fires are at. Somebody is starting these fires. Ain't no way that fires are in almost in every green place on the map that's like a forest of any sort. You may not be seeing this on the, the East Coast, but the West Coast, it's out, that's what it looks like. I looked on an app the other day and it showed just about every place out west. And I'm not, I didn't look all over. I definitely didn't look in Washington and, but yeah. The other day I was driving through Idaho and uh, there was a fire on the right hand side of the road. I wish that, um, I wish I had a better video than what I had because I deleted the video, but I only, the, the traffic actually started rolling once we started going, but the fire was right next to the road. And the only time they would let people come by is when the helicopter would dro drop water on it. That's the second time I've seen a fire with the helicopter that was dropping water, water. One time in Utah, in the mountains, and, uh, and the other day in Idaho. But... I go a few more miles down the road and there was another fire. As a matter of fact, there was another fire. Somebody's starting these fires. Nah. Nah. It was a little overcast, but I know there was no lightning that was starting no fires. Uh, I mean, I look over to my right. I end up calling 911 twice just to let people know that I saw where maybe possibly a fire was, but you couldn't see it. All you could see was smoke. And they were far enough away from the road that nothing was engulfed yet, so you couldn't tell if it was actually a fire or not. But, yeah, I know somebody's starting these fires. Because there's no way you could look on the map in just about every state where there's green, there's a fire. Of course, like I said, I didn't look everywhere, but I mean, it was everywhere on the map. Kind of hard to believe, probably one of those Antifa, somebody getting paid by the elite or somebody to go out and do some crazy stuff. Go some steal, steal some clothes and food from the stores and stuff like that and nobody doing anything about it. Yeah. Yeah, there's something behind all this crap. And what's what's the, the, the saddest thing is, is, like I said, look at how people act when they make comments. Like I said, I wasn't wrong when I sit here and saw people saying on Fox News where they thought that that airplane that was going from Texas to DC or wherever, wherever those Democrats were on, somebody said that they, they'd wish that airplane went down. I'm telling you, it don't make no difference what side people are on right now. There's wickedness in both. The saddest thing is when people are out here conformed to the ways of this world right now, thinking that evidently uh, we've got 50 to 100 years left or two or three or 400 years and can't even see what's going on around them. Is there a reason why that moon is red? I have not a clue. All I know is I googled it. Is there a blood moon right now? Was there that night? 
Last night, the moon was red too. The night before that, the moon was red. And I definitely don't think it has anything to do with no wildfires. I'm looking out right now. I'm here in Nebraska. I would have a better chance if there was fires that the sky would be dirty here than it would be if you were on the on the east coast. I don't see nothing wrong with the sky right now. I see that it's an overcast and I don't really see no sun today. I'm sure it's out there somewhere. It's darn well hidden. But, uh, I mean, I question today, where's the sun at? I don't see no sun at all. We're getting close, though. That's all that matters. We're getting close. Well, yeah, step outside at night. It's at nighttime that the moon is out. Right now, you wouldn't see the moon for nothing. But the last two or three nights, I've, or three or four, I mean, the last three or four days that I've witnessed the moon, I don't think I've witnessed it every night, but I mean, it's been red every night. And even if there was smoke in the sky, I would say it would be yellow, not red. That's what I'm witnessing. Getting closer and closer, closer and closer. I just hope people out here are saying things to their loved ones. It's pretty easy to expose how close we are. When this world isn't right right now, there's something wrong with it. People are something wrong with people right now. Like I said, people on truck stops don't want to hear anything about God. You may run across somebody here and there, but most people don't want to hear nothing about God. All you want to, all you'll witness is these atheists sit here well where's god out when something happens where's god yeah this is satan's world yeah ha, ha. yeah and as long as we were deserving death because of the what happened with rebellion the same thing that's happening in christianity right now rebellion uh no gonna get worse and worse But step outside and see if you can see if you can Google what time the sun's gonna be. I mean, the moon's gonna be out tonight. And step outside and tell me if it's not red or not. <laughs> 